programs we uh, we uh, what the institution for engineering program is five thousand USD. Yes. <laughs> okay, so the entry rate right now is 12.5. Okay, so but let me let me uh, mention the rest. And therefore, uh, the five thousand is for uh, engineering, including artificial intelligence. Because on the fly, you can see artificial intelligence and the informatics, but it is almost an engineering program. Do you understand? So it's five thousand USD. Five thousand USD for the yeah. Yes, including No, that's the future. <laughs> <laughs> that's the future. Okay, then um, for IT and computer science, that's 3,500 US per year. Then the business and the uh, communication has, that's 2,500 US per year. In the section of entrepreneurship, which is going for 3,000 USD per year. Because entrepreneurship will help you set up your business and then plan your own business even before you leave school. So those are the two children. So you can now shout. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> okay, you asked a question about scholarship. That's a very good question. She asked a question about scholarship, and I'm really interested. Let me just finish. Okay, please listen. For the scholarship program, if you want a scholarship in academic do you have to be very brilliant. Because it is very competitive. Last year, for instance, we had students who got more than 20 students who got straight A's who wanted a scholarship now. And it's limited. And we ended up with a scholarship to only 10, 10 students. Do you understand? So for the scholarship, you need a minimum of seven A's and a B. And then you will be invited for one or two interviews. If you pass that interview, then you can have the scholarship because it's a school scholarship. For now, we are not doing, we don't do the 50%, 30% scholarship. We do a full scholarship. So it covers your tuition, your accommodation, your, they, you are given a free laptop and uh, a monthly stipend. And then, what else? And then free food, free meals. All for the, all for the scholarship. That's how it works. That's why it's limited. So if you really want academic seat in vertical scholarship, your grade must what? Be excellent. And there's one other secret. Usually, to, if you are a girl, you even have advantage if you perform in terms of your exams and then the interviews. Do you understand? So put your best foot forward, make the grades, and be invited for your scholarship. You perform there, and then you can have it. Do you understand? Because the fact is that we do want more of the girls to venture into these engineering areas. Okay, so for now, we are not running any master's program. But we are working on one master's program. Paris, which area is that? Yes, data science. Data science, yeah, data science and analytics. But that is going to um, that will be launched to the scene. But currently, there are no master's programs. There's only undergraduate degree programs on campus. In some schools, for the scholarship, um, if you can't maintain your like certain GP, the scholarship is taken from. Is it the same? Year? Okay, so so far, I've started working here. No scholarship has been taken from any presidential scholar that I know of. Because you are here getting everything for free, what prevents you from learning and making the grades? Do you understand? So, so far, no presidential scholar has, um, no, nothing of that sort has happened. Because I believe most of them are keeping up with their grades, so it's not really an issue. If it's something that will happen in the future, I can't talk for But for now, usually the students who select as presidential scholars are very good enough that they are able to maintain their GPA, so we don't have issues of that sort. Artificial content girls and prime women to you. I'm thanking you for this opportunity to come to the whole institution. And we're very grateful for opening new vistas in our minds about the practical and technological aspects of life. We pray that we come here again, not just as visitors, but as students. As students.
My name is Jemima Dancy. I work here at the Buka Foundation as an admin assistant. I've been working here for three years now. We all know that um, Muslim ladies or Muslim women are supposed to dress in um, a kind of way, so they have to cover themselves. And the only part you see, for some places, it's just their faces that you see. For some, they show their hands and then their face. Yeah, yeah, That's all. But when you come, that is at the northern part. When you come to the southern part, of, um, most of the Muslims there do not mind. You can wear anything. <laughs> Whether long or short, even though they identify as Muslims, they wear whatever they want. Especially in the Zongo community. So these are the people that Kalimati is trying to address. And in her exhibition, so when you see the exhibition, it's a thing. When you see them, most of the dresses are there. Ones that we are used to, not the ones in the mountain. So we go and see the work. And if you have any questions, do let me know. This is our gallery. We have two gallery spaces. They are coming from Sapphire. Yes. 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 So this is known as the Sapo Flats, um, used by the people of Asapo when they have the ceremonial events or when they are going for war. So every Asapo has their own flats that they use. It's a permanent installation. It goes down as a twin to come down. Uh, the the Pawi shape aspect is also a permanent installation. There's the gift shop over there. There's a library. That's the person's name. The artist's name. Every okay. artist signed their work. But what's the name? The full e, name. That's Eugene Ejofo. Uh, he can't So he's a Ghanaian, right? Yes, he's Ghanaian. That's right. But some Arabic inscriptions. Okay. 
I know you may not have heard of Momo, but what does it mean to you? Your name? Trema. Okay, so this is what we'll do. When you're answering a question, you mention your name, and then I want to know the program you are reading. So your name, the program you are reading, and then you answer the question. So Trema, what's your program? General Arts. General Arts, okay. So I'm, I think it means creating um, collections, right, the wrong opportunities. And as you're opportunities, you're giving more money. You're giving more money. Okay. Let's clap for Trema. Is not send me more. They will block you. In fact, they will blacklist you. Because, ah, you said you want the person to mentally. I mean, of course, you know, you can get a part or a point in time where you have a certain kind of relationship with the person. And the person may be willing to help you. Maybe with your education, you can still help you. But you don't go with the mindset of milking them. Then, you know, she used to check on the lecturer at home. When she found the report with some of the things she was doing, the lecturer would teach. So it was a network, it was going well. Until at some point, the lecturer started seeing things that are beyond boundaries. Do you get what I'm saying? I'm saying this because the fact that I'm telling you that networking is very important and it will open doors for you does not mean that you should be gallant right? Yes. You don't necessarily need the people to make you who you are supposed to be. Do you get what I'm saying? So, yeah, you need some people to open some doors for you and you have to keep an eye and acknowledge those people and build contact with them. But when you realize that it's going beyond what it's supposed to be, and we are all adults, we know what is beyond and about going to be. When you realize that it is going that way, we don't say that because, oh, this person has a lot to offer me in this life. <coughs> And so you will do anything for me. Do you get what I'm saying? It's very important for me to emphasize on this. So you can actually tell the people off when they are going, when they are breaking their bars. Do you get what I'm saying? It doesn't mean you are blocking your future. It's just one person who would have benefited from it. Give me one place to connect with you. During what? During what? But not when you are right in the car. That's where you can do the connection is not bad. Thank you very much once again. My name is Ryan and I have this watching. If I want to be here, I would be able to So I would like to thank you. I'll see you. I hope that this has been helpful. What I'm giving to you is that keep an eye to those meaningful relationships and be sure to keep an eye on people who may want to Thank you very much for educating us on the topic of Let's <laughs> <laughs>